It is now. Okay, thank you. We'll proceed with the uh, Village of Cash Creek Calvary Council meeting for April 27th, 2020. And uh, seeing no delegations, we'll move on to the uh, adopting the minutes. So moved. Second. Discussion? Oh, is that? Uh, I think we're going to have to all speak up a little bit. The motion to adopt the minutes of the regular meeting of March 23rd, 2020 was moved by Councillor Defoe and seconded by Councillor Coomer. Okay. Any discussion? No. Okay. All in favor? Carried. Councillor Pittman? Yes. Maybe if just if uh, somebody opposes, they can speak out. Uh, is uh, Councillor Pittman that would probably be easier unless you specifically say you are opposed we will presume that you are in favor is that okay with you that's okay with me all right no delegations no business uh, business arising from the minutes seeing none with committee reports economic development uh, like Councillor Peters and Councillor Coomber um, no meeting, no report. I'd just like to note that uh, someday COVID-19 restrictions will be lifted and uh, I'm hoping that we will be prepared to uh, get our businesses kick-started back on the road to recovery. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Budget and Administrative Services, Councillor Peters and Councillor Coomber. No meetings, no report, as far as I know. Policy and bylaw review, myself and Councillor Peters. No meeting, no report. Other than, uh, would you have to go ahead, Martin? Yeah. You were at policy and bylaw review? Yes. Okay, we just have the amendment to the water rates. Yep. The council give final consideration to adopt the water rates amendment bylaw 813 2020. Second. Second. Discussion? Anybody opposed? Carried. Public Works and Community Facilities, myself and Councillor Defoe. The only thing I have really is, is what is our status with our facilities with the high water and the uh, water restrictions and are people complying? I think the water restrictions went out today again on our Facebook page. If I can uh, speak to that. Yeah. We uh, issued a uh, water advisory that was posted on, was it yesterday or the day before? It was the day before. So on Saturday, we'll, we'll double check the actual date, but uh, at least a day if not two before. Uh, we have had uh, several uh, uh, reports that people are continuing to irrigate. The uh, thinking uh, at the uh, EOC was that we needed to go door to door. We considered a uh, mailbox drop, but people are generally only collecting their mail uh, once a week because of COVID-19. So Public Works uh, will be going door to door tomorrow to hand out notices to the, telling people that they must restrict and that they are not allowed to water their lawns or wash their vehicles. Okay. I'd just like to add that Public Works has been outstanding during yeah. the flood event. They've been just so good. Does that answer your question, Councillor Defoe? It does, thank, okay. you. thank you. Village Services and Liaison, Councillor Defoe and Councillor Cougar. You're welcome. Other than that, no meeting, no report. Protective Services, myself and Councillor Cougar. Our fire department has been out and about many times. Our new, you know, our new emergency operations center uh, team has been activated. Right. Yeah. Uh, we've dealt with uh, a number of fires and uh, the floods, and uh, they've all responded um, very quickly and efficiently. So we're thankful for having uh, 15 members that we do have um, to assist us in this time, as well as sandbagging. Uh, and it, this goes on and on. And we're th we're grateful for that. Intergovernmental relations, myself and Councillor Coomer. Thank you, Ken. Mm -hmm. And on, on that note, uh, yes, thank you, Kamloops. And 
the numerous government agencies, but particularly uh, Councillor Coomber, Councillor DePoe, uh, Councillor Peters, our staff, those and our, especially our three councillors who have uh, gone above beyond their elected platform to uh, service, uh, provide a service to the citizens of Cash Creek. And uh, for that, and, and obviously, Lisa, you have many things on your plate. So does Wendy, and so does uh, um, Mrs. P Mrs. Peters. So, uh, with that being said, to contribute your time to our community in a time of need as you know, elected representatives, uh, that's exemplary, and uh, we thank you on behalf of the citizens of Cash Creek, and as well as our as our internal staff, uh, our CFO, CAO, and uh, our all of our staff. Um, almost everybody contributed. Mr. Mayor, you, you've been uh, pretty much on the scene yourself, uh, providing guidance and uh, help whenever you can. Mm -hmm. okay. So thank you all, and we're going to have a motion to move in the camera. Um, well, would there still uh, information for us on this new business questions from public, questions from the press? Martin, somebody just said the agenda. I said double sided to double sided. Fair enough. Read them off, Martin. We'll go one yeah. one. Yeah, sorry about that. Okay, the next item of business is information correspondence. There is none. Okay, okay. thank you. Uh, then new business. Any new business? Uh, Go ahead. Next one, Martin. Questions from the public, then questions from the press. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. All right. Uh, then a motion to go into closed session. Motion to move into closed session. So moved. Second. Okay. Any discussion? All in, all in favor? Carried. We'll move into a closed session. And I'll excuse myself. Uh, we don't need to yet. Okay. 